Hello guys, welcome back to my channel for another G-Shock tutorial video. So for today's, I'm going to unboxing and reviewing this model of GA-100A-9ADR. So this is an old model guys. So I don't have new for today, but uh, you know, let's check this out. Uh, what is special about this watch? And before we get started, just make sure you subscribe to the channel just by clicking the red button down there. So you can keep up to date with what's happening. So what we are waiting for guys. Let's do. The model of the watch is GA-100A-9EDR. 5081 case number. So you can see guys the box is different from others. Because this is an old model guys. So I'm sorry for the box because it's deformed. Anyway. Uh, let's see what's uh, special about this watch. So let's open it. So let's start here. International warranty card. One year coverage battery and machine. International warranty regulations. So inside the booklet, you can see all the business partner of G-Shop all over the world. And this is our company. Kuwait Al Battle Brothers Establishment. So we are the authorized dealer here in Kuwait. And of course, the module number 5081 or manual booklet guide. empty this is the watch okay so you can see the color is yellow glossy type specifications Case bezel material resin, resin band, Let's take a look at the watch back of the case. So engraving the G logo shock resist anti-magnetic shock absorbing structure. Casio 5081 case number. Model of the watch is GA-100A. Stainless steel back, Japan movement, and the watch is case in China. Water resist 20 bar, 200 meters water resistance. So let's move to buckle. So buckle is solid steel, and loop or keeper is resin. The band, the band is a little bit soft and it has a unique design. You can see here uh, in front of the band, so this is glossy type. So behind, behind or back of the band is a uh, mat. So 
So now let's move to the front of the watch. So on the bezel, we have a glossy resin. On the upper bezel, it's written here G-Shock. Below on the bezel is protection. On the screen, you can see the analog hand. So this small hand is for stopwatch. And this two small, small circle is for indicator in alarm, snooze, auto light, SIG. So the last circle is when you press uh, mode button, so you can see it's working. Okay, so these two negative display is for uh, digital hour. And the other one is uh, day and seconds. Okay. So, on the side, on the bezel, you can see the uh, buttons. So, it has a unique design. The watch, it has four buttons guys two from my left side and two from my right side so this is for adjust mode forward reverse so i will teach you every functions of the buttons guys so let's start here adjust adjust button is for adjusting the time so when you press hold after beep release now you can see the country, the three letters there is blinking. So that is Jeda. So for example, uh, I will search Dubai. DXB. Then press one time adjust. So it will set automatic. So now it's 9.13 in Dubai. And also the analog hand is synchronized. 9.13. Let's move to mode button. Mode button, it has stopwatch, timer, world time, alarm, and normal display configuration. Stopwatch. So when you press start, this is for this forward, this is start. Stop, forward again. And reset adjust mode again for timer so timer like one minute countdown so press adjust hold same procedure when you're adjusting the time guys press adjust hold after beep release so mode One minute, then press one time adjust and start. We are near. So that is timer, guys. So mode again for world time. So forty nine countries. You can see here like you can check also other time of other countries so london madrid so 6 30 rome berlin athens cairo jeddah dubai kabul delhi dhaka 
Bangkok, Singapore, Hong Kong, Beijing, Taipei, Tokyo. So that is world time. Alarm. So how many alarms we have? Three, four, four alarm and one snooze. So how how to use the alarm? So same procedure when you are adjusting the time. Press adjust hold after beep release. So for example, forward button. Three in the morning. And press one time adjust. So the alarm is active. Normal display configuration. So this reverse is light. And if you press forward, so it will change to digital hour. So if you press again one time, so it will change it will change to uh, months and date. So there are two display configuration for this. Okay, so let's try this on my wrist. You know, I really like the color. But I'm not a fan of yellow, guys. But I, I do love color yellow. See? Date release of this watch last March 16, 2010. The price of the watch is $137. In Philippine money is $6,863 pesos, guys. Okay, guys. So, that is it. Thank you so much for watching until the end. And I hope you learn from our video. And if yes, please comment down below for more suggestions. Uh, like, share, and subscribe, and see you on my next vlog, guys. Peace.